Cancer, welcome. Cancer, we're going to do a general read for you guys today. Looking at your current energy, desire, the outcome, what's working for you, what you need to be aware of. <clears throat> Keep in mind what you may need to be aware of. Could be a good thing. Uh, we will clarify all those cards once we have them on the table. And then at the end, we will pull three more cards around the read just to make sure that we have everything in place that you may need. So, Cancer, let's get started and see what's going on for you guys this week. Cards are just flipping everywhere. Uh, interesting. <clears throat> Sun card, current energy, very nice. Uh, happiness abounds. The desire, three of pentacles. The desire to work on something. Uh, maybe this is also, um, things are starting to pay off and you're starting, or you're hoping things are going to start to pay off soon. Knight of Cups shows up as what the outcome is, so maybe some type of romance. King of Cups shows up uh, in what is working for you. Creativity. Mastery over self. <clears throat> Six of Wands shows up in what you need to be aware of. Um, oi, I'm just having major card malfunctions here, sorry. Um, the Six of Wands shows up, as in what is what you need to be aware of. And the Six of Wands, uh, there's success here. Uh, you're starting to achieve. So let's go through, let's start to figure out what's going on here. A lot of Leo energy. Okay, and I've got stuff that's turning upside down right now. Uh, I don't normally read <clears throat> with them in reverse. The Leo energy that you're experiencing, we have the Strength card, the Four of Wands, and the Queen of Cups. Um, it's like you're going through the whole thing of, I almost want to say nesting. Uh, this seems to be that there is a relationship, it's happy, it's taking, you know, some effort to make things stable. You've got the Queen of Cups where you're not really feeling overwhelmed, but you're also feeling uh, Queen of Cups is your energy. So maybe you're not even feeling, if I read it in reverse, maybe you're not even feeling like yourself right now. Now the Three of Pentacles. <clears throat> Nine of Swords, Six of Swords, Page of Swords. You're wanting things to move forward in a different way. You're wanting to see those um, kind of milestones. It seems like it's been a bit of a grind. And if I read this in reverse, it was that There's been delay, but you're not using the right, to, you know, you need to look at it, you know, maybe you're following it like a formula to get there, but it seems to have taken the creativity out of it. Uh, kind of interesting. The Knight of Cups, we have the Ace of Wands, the Star card, and the Lovers. Very nice. <clears throat> In the outcome. This feels like, for some of you, the romance that's coming in, um, I get that somebody's manifested you. Uh, you've hoped for, you know, to be swept off your feet. And yeah, it's coming in with the lovers here. The King of Cups. We have the Queen of Swords. We have the Four of Swords. And we have the Nine of Wands. Um, The creativity and master over your emotions is really making a difference. Staking your boundaries and not being emotional about it um, may feel stressful at first and may feel counterintuitive, but in reality, it's probably a really good thing for you to do. Uh, the Six of Wands, we have the High Priestess, which is your energy, the Eight of Cups, and the Wheel. <clears throat> It takes a lot, and this is what you need to be aware of. It takes a lot to walk away from something where it could put you in the limelight. It can put you in the spotlight 
where you could be under attack, but you seem to weather that really, really well. And things start to move. This is a catalyst. Knight of Swords, the Tower, and the Hermit. It's almost like there's no secret. There's no secret to the whole idea that you're trying to chase down what is yours or what your goals are. Um, you're being quick about things, you're looking at things, you're making decisions, but at the same time, there's nothing new that is shocking you. It's like you've been through the ringer and you understand that this is all part of your journey uh, with the hermit here. Cancer, that's what I have for you today. Sorry about the cards falling out weird, but uh, I've never done a read with them in reverse. So this is a first time for me. Thank you for being here. Feel free to give this a thumbs up or a thumbs down and leave, or leave me a comment. And f remember to subscribe if you have not done so already. Thank you all for being here. We'll talk to you next time.